the grants from the government have allowed us to work in academia at Duke University and others such as Baylor and Houston with Valencell to move the technology forward at a very rapid pace. I'm impressed with the way Valencell has pursued independent testing from the very beginning. This will allow them to carry the devices into the clinical setting with alacrity by passing federal standards from the beginning. I can't tell you how excited I am to see this work come to fruition and to be able to be on the cusp of carrying it into the clinical environment. This is exactly the way the field needs to move and I'm very happy to be working with Valence on this product. I think as a partnership, we're going to end up in the ideal place. The reason why people license our technology is primarily because of the accuracy. It's critical for anything cool you want to do with a biometric tracker. If you don't have accuracy, then frankly all it is is a mood ring. There were several aha moments. Uh, the first aha moment is when we invented it, when we realized that this would work, and we re reduced it to practice, and followed a bunch of patents on the technology. The second aha moment was when we realized the best place to put the sensors in the body. I'd say the third aha moment is when we started passing all these crazy tests, and we were like, yeah, we're really on to something. Our early partners, they'd come to us and they'd say, you know, you guys really have something here. And that's kind of when we knew it was, it, was, it was definitely going where we had hoped it would go. When you go online and look at reviews of products that are powered by PerformTech, what you find is that what people say is it just works. It just works. Uh, whether it's an armband, an earbud, a wristband, or whatever, people are very extremely happy with the accuracy. So that sets us apart from everybody else because uh, it's easy to make a heart rate monitor that doesn't work well, but it's really, really hard to make one that actually will work well and, and work well in a consumer form factor. Valence Cell Solution has three parts to it. One is a design. The other is a chip with firmware and software on it for doing the signal extraction. The third thing is the API. The API is how you talk to that chip with simple commands. You tell that chip what you want and it gives it to you when you want it. So that whole process is how you make an application. So our partners make mobile applications with our technology all the time. As a matter of fact, to date, not a single partner has launched a product without making their own app to go with it. Though that said, most of our partners today have their technology, their product rather, working with a number of different platforms. So for example, all the more recently launched products work with all of the Bluetooth enabled heart rate monitor brands. So companies like Map My Fitness, RunKeeper, Runtastic, Indomano, Strava, uh, they have applications that work based off Bluetooth heart rate. And so our partners' products will work with those apps. So Valencell has developed a product certification process and a manufacturer certification process that's been tested. It's, it's tried and true, uh, used again and again and again to assure that your product is going to be awesome and that who is going to manufacture it for you is going to be awesome. In order to make a company that can solve biometric problems, it needs to be a very multidisciplinary team with strong science and engineering skill set and strong validation skill sets. So our team is composed of mechanical engineers, electrical engineers, uh, exercise physiology specialists. We also have folks who have a lot of expertise in software, firmware, people who have expertise in biomedical sciences. We have a uh, a principal optomechanical engineer who focuses on all the hardcore optics and the next generation optics that the company is going to be using in its products. Uh, this type of thing is required. So when you want to make a, an accurate biometric wearable, you can't half-ass it. you got a full-ass it. And, and the way we do it is with this multidisciplinary team.